don't really know what to call you when we talk like this. God. Allah. Jehovah. I don't think you really name it, need a name, do you? To give you a name would to be to say that you're just like all the rest. Like all the vermin. <laughs> those brain dead sheep who follow those man made cults they call religions. Horrible organizations protecting child molesters and terrorists. But of course, the majority of the moronic filth on this planet based their whole existence by whichever one of these cults they belong to. Well, you will be glad to know that I am taking another one out tonight. I will shut them down. I will cleanse this cesspit and bring the global average intelligence up a fraction of a fraction. I will pop the eyesore of a pimple on this beautiful, glorious, astronomical object that we were gifted. I just wish I had more time. Wish I could devote my time to exterminating every filthy cretin from your world. Unfortunately, the world is run by money. And I must lower myself to please my semi-retarded pencil pushing boss in that filthy office just to finance this extermination. Must be nearly that time. Let's go see what filthy creatures that are roaming the dirty streets tonight, shall we? You do realize that I must damage this one tonight before I take it from its miserable existence. It must suffer before I shut it down. Okay, let's go. <laughs> it's so easy. It's so easy. They're like zombies. 
roaming around without a brain in their head. <laughs> no direction, no sense, no clue or idea how to even exist. Look at this filthy bitch. This filthy lump of human flesh hanging on a pointless skeleton filled with diseased and poisoned organs. A waste of time and a waste of life. A thieving bitch stealing oxygen from a planet she doesn't even have a right to inhabit. Look at this vile creature. I should burn this rat whore in front of her empty minded bastard parents. What way will I shut her down? I could slit her throat. But no, it's too messy. <laughs> I remember the last time I did that. I couldn't believe how much blood there was. It was like a red river. <laughs> red water. Red water. <laughs> It was warm. And I liked it. But it's too messy. And I'm too tired to clean up that mess. I could put a bag over her head. A see-through one. So I could see her suffer and squirm. Watch as the last breaths of a life she doesn't deserve drains right out of her. <laughs> or I could drive her nose bone right up into her tiny brain. Crunch! <laughs> crunch, crunch, crunch! <laughs> Who the fuck are you? What the fuck's going on? Shut your mouth. Shut your horrible whore mouth. Don't you ever use that language in this house again. You will never look at me again or I will gouge your eyes out. Do you hear me? I do the talking around here. You will shut your whore mouth and die! <laughs> Look at you. This didn't need to be you here tonight. This could have been someone else. But look at you. And people say that we're the sick ones. I'm sick. You drink that poison liquid. Numbing your senses and dissolving your reality. Just to facilitate an excuse, your need to have sex with complete strangers, <coughs> waking up the next morning, not knowing what you did or how you even got there. <coughs> but I'm the sick one. <laughs> you and your type get pregnant. You give birth to unwanted children, to one single horrible parent in an unloved, miserable existence. <laughs> but I'm sick. Look at you. <laughs> no, there is a lack of nurture. There is a lack of guidance, a lack of direction, a lack of knowledge how to even exist. I'm sick. 
You sit around eating disgusting processed garbage on a flashy white screen that's designed to program your weak mind to fit the agenda of a few global elite families on this planet who control our very existence. You're like sheep, always spending and consuming and dragging and dictating. You just jump on the conveyor belt like all the rest of the clones. <laughs> Until your body finds a disease that your horrible lifestyle has decided to give it. Don't you look at me. <laughs> you are a cancer on this beautiful planet. You are a lump getting bigger and wider every day. Well, I am here to purge you. Never learn. Please. You Please. never learn. Why can't you accept <laughs> your fate? You are going to die. No. You do not deserve to live. And as for your children, I'm sure I'll meet them. No. no. But they will have some chance once your life is removed from existence. No. Now I'm sick looking at you. I am on a mission to remove the unintelligent, the uneducated, the unclean, the unuseful pieces from this planet. It is time to shut you down. No. 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 Okay. Die. No.